And 28 more of the students abducted from Bethel Baptist College in Chikun local government area of Kaduna State have been released. They were freed on Saturday night at a village in Chikun local council after spending 21 days in the hands of their abductors. With tears of joy flowing freely, the parents received their children by the guardians of the remaining 85 children still in captivity. Their sleepless nights continue. TBC News correspondent Lupe Asom reports. It begins with a prayer session by parents who have received the good news that their children have been released and can't wait to see them. 28 of them were released Saturday night at a village in Chikun local council after 21 days in the hands of their abductors. Parents erupt in excitement as the students arrive at the school premises. The type of joy when I have. Joy, joy. God has started and he will end it. We will never miss any child. The rest will come back. I feel happy, feel joy, and I'm praising God. I'm happy about joy. 121 students were abducted from Bethel Baptist College, located along the troubled Kaduna Kachia Road. Two of them were earlier released, while another was later freed due to poor health. 85 of them still languish in the hands of the bandits. Parents of the students and officials of the school say the government needs to do a lot more to improve the security situation in the state and the country at large. Whatever he was doing should have resulted into the release of these children before now. However, they were not released and we kept being agitated. We wanted the promise of the governor uh, to be fulfilled earlier than it finally got fulfilled. Right now, uh, I cannot say exactly what he has done because he himself was not ready to give us the details of what he would be doing. Nigerian people are like widows. You know, widows doesn't have husbands, you know, in one way, they are weak. So people in Nigeria are like widows. No, there's no government, I can, if I can say. Go to government, they need to do more. It's a shame what is happening here. If one America was kidnapped in Niger, they brought him to Nigeria. And then the America came and just threw their child, one child, and to our, to our government here. It's a shame. For the, release, the school management assures the negotiations are still ongoing with the bandits, who say the children will be released in batches. Parents who are yet to see their children still hope they will be released in good condition. Lupe Asong, TVC News, Kaduna.